Good morning, Year 3 Amber. For today's maths lesson, we will be looking at time and we will be converting minutes into seconds. So today's LI is to convert minutes into seconds. Please pause the video while you copy this down and I'll go on to show you clocks around the house. So what I'm going to do with you now is show you various clocks around the house. Now what I'd like you to look out for is the hand that's moving, which counts the seconds in time. I'd like you to see how many spaces the hand moves around the clock face from its starting position to when it gets back to that starting position and see if you can guess roughly how many times the second hand jumps around the clock face. So, how many jumps of that ha second hand did you count? If you were anywhere in the 50 to 60s, um, if you counted anywhere from 50 to 60, you were right, because there are 60 seconds in a minute. I'm now going to show you this in a digital form of heating my cup of coffee up in a microwave for one minute. So now, Year 3, I'm going to heat the milk up for my cup of coffee for one minute. See if you can count down the seconds of the timer to see how many seconds are in that minute.
Right, I'm going to take my milk out of the microwave. See if you can guess how many seconds I heated my milk up for. So how many seconds there are in a minute, because I put it on for one minute, while I brew this mighty cuppa. So from that video, if you're counting down the seconds along with the display, you might have noticed 59 or 60 seconds. The correct answer is actually 60 seconds, because if you include the one minute sign, that is 60 seconds, there are 60 seconds in one minute. So a few minutes have passed and my cup of coffee is now cold. I wonder how hot it will be after I heat it up for two minutes. As I said before, see if you can count down the seconds along with the display and see how many seconds are in two minutes. It should be double, twice as much as it is in one minute. Let's go. Well, that looks way too hot, and my parents aren't going to be happy with me either, so I'll leave that for a bit. So, should have counted two lots of 60 seconds, as I said before, they are, t are heating my coffee for two minutes. So, the reason why I got 120 seconds is that two lots of 60 seconds make 120 seconds, which is therefore two minutes. So let me take this back for you. So two minutes, that's 120 seconds. It's 120 seconds because it's two lots of 60 seconds and 60 seconds is a minute. There are 60 seconds in a minute, two minutes, 120 seconds, 60 add 60 is 120. As I was explaining earlier, there are two lots of 60 seconds in two minutes. So let me add this up really quickly. So zero add zero. So I'm using column method. And six and six, so two lots of six is 12. So 
So there we have 120 seconds. So what we're going to do now, year three, is see how many seconds there are in one minute, three minutes, and five minutes. So what we have here is our working out for each of the groups of minutes. So in one minute, we just have 60 seconds. In three minutes, we have three lots of 60 seconds. There being 60 seconds per minute, and three lots of 60 as there are three minutes. And for five, we are adding five lots of 60 because there's 60 seconds per minute and there are five minutes. Please pause the video whilst you have a go at working this out. So after you've had a go at working this out, let me go through the answers with you. So, 60 plus nothing, because there are only 60 seconds in a minute, is 60. So, three minutes, which we will be adding three lots of 60. So six add six, as I demonstrated here, is 12. Add another six to 12, 180. Because three sixes are 18, and three zeros, we get the answer zero. So by adding a zero, we're effectively timesing 18 by 10, adding a zero, making it 180. So for five minutes, we're effectively adding two lots of six to three lots of six. So let me circle these. So, three lots of six is, is 180. Two lots of six is 120. So let's add these together. So, zero add zero. Nothing. Eight add two, ten. Carry over one. Two, one add one is two, plus one is three. So there are 300 seconds in five minutes. So next time you look at a clock, either a clock with hands or a digital clock, anywhere you go, whether that be around the house or someone else's house, I'd like you to remember what I call the 60 second rule, which means there are 60 seconds in a minute. So the fast hand goes round for 60 seconds, and every 60 seconds, the larger hand, which is the minute hand, will move because the second hand, so the hand that counts the seconds which goes round quickly, has gone round for 60 seconds. So, if you want to know how many seconds there are in, for example, two minutes or five minutes, you just have to add up lots of 60 seconds. So, two lots of 60 seconds for two minutes and five lots of 60 seconds for five minutes. So, helps to know your six times tables, but if not, just get a sheet, do some column method which is my preferred way of adding, and add your lots of 60 seconds, as that's how many seconds there are in a minute. Thank you very much, Year 3. I hope you had a good morning.